Welcome to Sleepy Eyes. I am your host, Varga. I take you on a journey in the dark of the night with warm tales. Take a moment to relax your body and mind with the current calmness. Breathe deeply, feel the energy inside, and let go of any tiredness. Put aside the past and focus on the peacefulness of the present moment. Recognize any tension in your body. Allow it to fade away and unwind. Discover your inner peace and simply unwind in the tranquility of now. Before going to sleep, prepare to read a story comfortably in this peaceful setting. Let the magic of words captivate you as you get lost in a tale or story. With the warmth from this peace and relaxation, your sleep will become even more serene. Close your eyes, embark on a journey with a touch of words. Let each word guide you a bit deeper toward the essence of your inner peace. Now, relax and enjoy the pleasure of getting lost in the enchanting world of the story before drifting into sleep. Reflections of a Fractured World by Sleepy Eyes In the bleak heart of a dystopian realm, the hum of surveillance drones overhead punctuated the ominous silence that hung heavily in the air. Frescoes of desolation sketched a grim outline of the world once inhabited by Arik Frost. Through the stark concrete corridors of the underground bunker, he meandered, his footfall echoing in the cavernous expanse, akin to the regret that echoed in his heart. Arik Frost was not a man you would pass by unnoticed. He carried a presence, a sense of authority woven with an intriguing undertone of mystery. His short hair, as dark as the world outside, framed his narrow face, wallpapered with lines of concern and speckled with distinctive marks that chronicled his trials and tribulations. His cold blue eyes were the only colored accents in this monochromy world, a pair of orbs worn by years of torment and guilt, yet burning with unyielding resilience. Once a beacon of hope, Ark had discovered a solution to the energy crisis, his revolutionary solution lighting up the world, metaphorically and literally. However, the high price of progress came knocking. It wasn't long before his solution was bastardized by oppressive powers, transforming the world into the dystopian nightmare it was now. Arik stood as an embodiment of a tragic irony, the savior turned inadvertent curse of humanity. Haunted by his creation's misuse, Arik found sanctuary amidst the oppressed. He led the resistance his brilliant mind and scruffy charisma rallying and inspiring people who had long given up on hope. His criticisms of the establishment, raw and thought-provoking, earned him many followers and even more enemies. His life now a cocktail of danger, guilt, and determination, Arik stepped up to right the wrongs he had inadvertently caused in this dystopian thunderdome. His resourcefulness and resilience were his aegis, steeled by the courage and conviction imbued by the guilt he carried within him. As his nimble fingers danced over a weather-beaten keyboard, the glow of his monitor cast haunting shadows across his face. Each keystroke was a punch based against the tyrannical order that lorded over the world above. Not much longer, he murmured promising himself more than anyone else. Soon, he would expose the truth and pull the system down from its twisted roots, needed for the world's rebirth. His determination washed over him like a cold wave, chilling him to his depths, but also invigorating him with a sense of purpose. Indeed, Arik Frost's journey was a latticework of trials, tension, unwavering conviction, and a sprinkling of hope weaving through the fabric of a dystopian world he once inadvertently molded. And through it all, his blue eyes, cold and introspective, only grew brighter. In them, a reflection of not the fractured world of today, but the world of a hopeful tomorrow. 
the testament to Arik's unconquerable spirit, to the never-ending battle against the system. Keep moving, Arik. Forward, he whispered into the deaf darkness, his voice loud against the heavy, oppressive silence. His words hung in the air like an unfinished symphony, a symphony of rebellion, redemption, and resurrection. His tale was a testament that even in the most dystopian worlds, the human spirit remains unbroken, continuing to fight, striding forward towards an unseen dawn.